settling with you. I have girlfriends in marriages right now who have settled with the nice, safe, secure guy we weren't all that attracted to. We didn't really want that much. We didn't have any chemistry with. We had meh sex with because we had to. Because the guy we actually felt passion and chemistry for doesn't want us or makes us so emotionally unhinged and erratic that we can't look ourselves in the mirror anymore. Normally, those guys that we settle for don't make it happen. To us, it's like, well, damn, if you're putting up with it, <laughs> okay, cool. If you're still here, cool. When you want to go, that's fine. But in the meantime, I got no one else. You're here to give it. Cool. I accept. But my God, I see how pathetic you are. And I will definitely use that to my advantage. We'd leave you in a heartbeat if someone better came along. You can't make this shit up. You can't make this shit up. A hard pill to swallow, but nothing that most of us in this space don't already know. What's going on YouTube? It's your boy Rome back with another video. If you're new to the platform, welcome to the tribe. By the end of this video, I hope you subscribe. Now, I believe she go yeah, she goes by the name Jessica J Dating. Um, uh, she's been on YouTube for a while. Um however, I gotta give a little bit of pushback. Because, you know, it's a lot of women nowadays are saying they're not going to settle. And then when they do, oh, I settled for him. I could have done better, which is translation for I could have been screwing somebody better than you. But they didn't want to give me the commitment that I wanted. So therefore, I settled for you because you were willing to give me the commitment that I was looking for. So that's basically what it is. But I would actually argue that it's actually men that are the ones settling. And I'm going to show you a clip that proves that. Check this out. Y'all keep talking about y'all won't settle. These black men have had to settle. Y'all not virgins. Settle. Bruh. You coming with kids. Settle. Ooh. You coming with multiple baby daddies. Settle, settle. Have a shake. Settle. Angry, bad attitude. Settle. Masculine as fuck. Fake hair, fake nails, fake lashes, fake face. Settle. Now y'all have the nerve, the audacity, and the bonus to say you're settling. And you won't even date a bus driver. Then you try to clean up talking about you just want black men to excel. Well then they should get their passport and go somewhere else and find women that will inspire them to because y'all ain't it. Not over here in delusion land. <laughs> but good luck. Settle, settle. <laughs> Finish her. Fatality. Uh, yeah, I wasn't expecting the passport plug um, on that one, but <sighs> here's the thing, man. What, what, what I've come to realize is that the things that men value in terms of finding something long term, I, I've really just come to the conclusion that women don't really care or value those things themselves. And when you consider everything that she mentioned, because this is stuff that spe specifically black men, but men in general, we've been saying it for a while now that like we don't like this shit. We don't like the fake hair. We don't like the long ass nails. We ain't we ain't dealing with the masculine attitude. We don't give a damn how much money you make. Like you know what I mean? I'm like I'm still the leader of this of this family in this house. They they just they really don't care, man. They have this frame of mind of you're gonna accept everything a as I am, and you're gonna put up with it. And if you don't and if you don't put up with it, like like the woman in the first clip mentioned, oh then I'm just gonna find somebody else. Get the French toast out of here. See, it's, I want to say it's the illusion of choice because yeah, women are always going to have more options and choices, but they don't have the choices that they really think that they have because they, because they get, they get the sexual attention confused with the um, commitment, you know, as far as coming from men. So 
uh yeah that's not gonna work man so i i agree man i i would argue men settle more than women let's keep it moving choose somebody who you know loves you enough to change your diaper don't sit there and choose somebody for your 20 some year old self your 30 some year old self you better choose somebody for your 70 year old self and i can tell you this as a woman after 40 years after all that my husband and i been through when it was time to bury my family he had me when it was time to bury his mother and father i had him when it was time to go through sickness we had each other when you have that person and they have proven through the through the, the the time that they are with you let me tell you something you better prepare for this stage of your life yeah i definitely agree with her on that one because as you as you guys know i just um buried my father recently and seeing you know over damn what's been like the last 20 years give or take of my mom pretty much having to take care of my father you know once he got sick because he had his he had his first he had his first stroke my senior year in high school so yeah it's about 20 years now because i'm 38 and you know been there with him you know up until he passed earlier this year been with him through thick and thin sickness and in health uh took him everywhere he needed to go and all that you know obviously i helped when i could but when i think about how women are now i would argue most women wouldn't be there you know for their husbands the, the same way my mom was for my dad um because i'm like 20 years that's a long time i mean not to mention you know a good portion majority of those years she was still working so yeah man that 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 that's a lot bro and that's so hard to find nowadays let's keep it moving who would you say loves harder men or women i think women loves harder i saw this one video a guy asked a whole bunch of women mm -hmm. if a grim reaper came right now and said i'm gonna kill you or your husband who should i kill Azrael gelse oh, dese ki, senin mi alayım, mi? Kimi tercih eder? all the women were like kill my husband Take my husband. Why would I die? Sevgilimin. Sevgilimin. Valla eşimi kine alsın. Eşimi kine alsın. He asked the same question to men. They're all like, take me. I don't want my wife to die. Kendimi. Ben canımı alsın. Ben ikin alsın eşimi kine alsın. Ben ikin alsın kendimi. Women love easier. Yeah. But I think men love harder. He's definitely right about that. Men do love harder. You see, women may cry a lot and may show a lot of emotion in regard to how much they love. But a lot of it is just smoke and mirrors. A lot of it is noise, which we're very good at. But when it comes to the nitty gritty, men win hands down. Because anyone that will give their life for someone that they love, that's true love. Women certainly fall in love easier, I believe. But as easy as they fall in love is as easy as they fall out of love. Facts. A woman can leave a man because of hypergamy. A woman can leave a man because she's bored. Uh -huh. A woman can leave a man just because she feels she's not happy anymore and he didn't even do anything. A woman can leave a man because he didn't clean the house enough. Women oftentimes leave men for the most frivolous of reasons. But even though most men are not over the top with their day-to-day -day expressions of love, they're not doing cartwheels through through valleys and fields. But when it comes down to it, men are the true romantics. I said this in one of my videos that men invented romance. It's them. They're the true romantics. It's not us. For women, love is very often like a revolving door. Someone comes in, someone can go out just as easy as they came in because we're dominated by our emotions. And our emotions can change like the weather. That's why it oftentimes takes men so long to fall in love and or to commit because they know the decision they're making. They're making the decision till death do us part. So men should always keep that in mind when you're with a woman. Her love is conditional. And as fast as she fell in love with you, for many women, they can fall out of love as fast as they fell in love. A woman's love is conditional. 
And because of that, that is why I will always say men love harder and we are the true romantic because we're willing to give we're willing to put our life on the line for our women we we literally will do romantic things in order to get validation and in some cases let's keep it a buck sexual pleasure from our women it's like there 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 there's just certain things that men do for women that women will rarely if not ever do for men so uh, i can't disagree with any of that man and y'all let me know what y'all thought about this all right if you're new to the platform please subscribe oh geez i appreciate the love and support make sure y'all hitting that bell notification that way i know what i'm uploading hit the like button because it helps with the algorithm and helps me reach a broader audience also look out for the travel vlog channel unplugged traveler link is in the description as well as my latest mixtape neo trap volume one and if you want to purchase any other merch the spreadshot.com link is in the description until the next video y'all deuces